As farmers seeded their crop this spring, the challenge, as always, how to spend less but grow more. We have oats and barley. Jocelyn Valestic strategically mixes and rotates crops to fertilize the soil naturally. We can put whatever we want in our mix that will grow the best and will improve the soil at the same time. But in order to get a profitable yield, she still spends more than $100,000 a year on manufactured fertilizer. We want to make sure we get that fertilizer to the plant and it is no good to us if we've paid for fertilizer that's in the atmosphere. In Western Canada, farmers have increased the use of nitrogen fertilizer by more than 150% since the 80s. The result is record-breaking yields and more food for the world. But it also comes at a cost to the environment. Some fertilizer is wasted. For example, after a farmer seeds and fertilizes, the plant can only use a certain amount and not all at once. A heavy rain can cause excess fertilizer to convert to nitrous oxide, a greenhouse gas 300 times more potent than carbon dioxide. Fertilizer use is responsible for so much nitrous oxide, it's equivalent to driving more than two and a half million cars for a year. Tyler Kessler is an agronomist who advises farmers on how to reduce fertilizer waste. When the farmer is uh, making economical decisions uh, based on data and precision agriculture, the environment wins every time because we're not over applying where we don't need to be. He takes soil samples and collects data from moisture probes to map the yield potential. Then he calculates the best kind of fertilizer, how much and where and when to use it. I write a prescription that goes into the tractor, into the drill, um, and the, it tells it where to put the fertilizer and at what rate. The fertilizers are evolving too. Slow release fertilizers give the plants more time to absorb them. Nitrification inhibitors can potentially reduce how much converts to gas. And so-called smart fertilizers, still being developed, would only respond to what the plant needs. Efficient fertilizer use is the new farming frontier. We're kind of on the, the cusp of it. How to grow the most food while trying to save money and the environment. Bonnie Allen, CBC News, near Regina.